large just to give the committee an idea of where things may be going. So we've had some conversation, uh, our office, Corp Council, with the Council for the Town, and we have received a response from them that the Town Attorney is stating that while he can't say with certainty whether they will take the matter up, he is advising them not to since their collective position has been compromised for any further quasi-judicial decisions. Yeah. And so with that, um, we're of the understanding that uh, nothing would be happening at the town level and for us to wait to January, uh, we wouldn't necessarily have to if Lafarge has addressed all the concerns that were brought up at the meeting. And uh, right now in our conversation with them, they feel that they have addressed those things. They don't necessarily know if they're ready for December, but if they are, I guess I was just bringing this forward to the committee just to be aware that if, if they are ready, if the committee would be willing for them or would the committee rather wait until January um, is what was stated as, as long as it, you know, it, let me let me get this straight. So they aren't going to make a, take a vote on it. So the uh, town attorney is indicating that he's advising them uh, not to. Okay, you said because they were compromised. What does that mean? It was in regards to what took place at this meeting uh, with a couple of the town board supervisors being uh, present. And when they weren't supposed to be present. Well. There are, there are some things that could cause issue. Yeah, I thought it was actually very revealing that they were here and very helpful. <laughs> so, um, I, I mean, anything more, I, you know, yeah. we'd have to get information from Wheatland. I don't think I'm able to provide the legal words and things uh, regarding that, but that's what they're indicating to us. And so based upon that, we believe that um, we could entertain the item in December if Lafarge is ready to go. 